Are you ready? The lions have called a limo to come pick you up. You don't want to keep them waiting. I don't know if I could do this. Three lions is in a coma. How am I supposed to marry a man in a coma and give him a baby? Ellie Holland, you listen to me good. If you don't marry Wayne Lyons and produce them an heir, your father is going to die. We don't have enough money for his treatment. But I don't see how that's a problem. Dad's company is doing just fine. Your father's company has been losing money for years. There's nothing left. What's wrong? Getting cold feet? I would too if I had to marry a half-done man. Who also happens to be my boyfriend's cousin? God, this is a mess. He's your father too, Sasha. Yeah, but you're his favorite, so it's your responsibility. Unless you want to watch our father die. Fine. I'll marry Wayne Lyons. Very good. So this is my husband. My cousin Wayne kicks the bucket. I'll marry the bitch and take over the company. So this is my husband. Is that Sasha and my boyfriend? <sighs> oh, really, how long does this have to go on for? I have to stay with Ellie until she gets knocked out. My cousin Wayne kicks the bucket. I'll marry the bitch and take over the company. What about the baby? She's not gonna give you custody. She will. I told her I'll treat her like my own. With the heir of the Lions Corporation under my custody, the company will be mine. Then, we'll be together, baby. Oh, I can't believe this. He's been lying to me. All time. And I'll treat your baby like my own, I promise. I know you're fucking my half-sister. I know your plan. I had to sneak away from the party downstairs to come and find you. It wasn't easy, but here I am. I just had to see you. What are you doing here, Roger? I wasn't going to let my girl get married off without telling her how much I love her. You still love me. Of course. Some fake marriage isn't going to change that. Plus, I know you're just doing it for your father. Everyone knows my cousin doesn't have much longer to live. This is just my aunt's last ditch effort to ensure an heir is produced. <laughs> when he dies, we'll be together. And I'll treat your baby like my own, I promise. Get the hell away from me. I know you're fucking my half-sister. I know your plan. I mean, how stupid of you to do this under my nose! I can explain. Ellie, hey, listen. Get, get, me, get your hands off of me! You lying Brit! We're over! I never want to see you again. Oh my god. You're awake. Where is she? Well, that's Ellie Holland, your wife. I can't believe this. This is a miracle. Oh, will my son be all right? Madam, we're still running tests and we'll know shortly. Oh, 
baby. Oh, you're awake. You were in a deep coma for six months. I thought I'd lost you forever. Mother, where is she? Oh, well, that's Ellie Holland, your wife. What the hell are you talking about? Since when did I get married? Listen, I had to make sure the family line would continue. And she's from a good family. She got a good education. You're being ridiculous. I want a divorce. Now... Hey, buddy, this is no picnic for me either. Oh, no, son, why? She's your lucky star. You awoke just as soon as she got here. This had nothing to do with her being from a good family. Or my lucky star. This is about you. You and your aspirations. How can you say that about your poor mother? Do you know how much I paid for this? Five million. Oh, wow. Five million? Thank you, mother. You were so worried about your precious family lineage that you hoard out your comatose son to a stranger. Mom? Barbara? Mom! Barbara. Mom! Doctor! Mom! I don't want to be in this situation any more than you do. The thing is, my dad had a stroke, and we need money for his treatment. Is my mom okay? Yeah. The doctor just took her to get some rest. Look. I don't want to be in this situation any more than you do. But the thing is, my dad had a stroke, and we need money for his treatment. Did my mom say you were like from an impactful family? That usually means loaded. I suppose we were, but for some reason, my dad's company doesn't have any money anymore. And your mother offered us money for his treatment. If I married you. That sounds like something she would do. I just woke up. I still need to figure out who's behind my car accident. It might be a good idea to keep her around for a bit. Let's... Let's table this discussion at least until my mom gets better. Huh? Great. I'm tired. Get some sleep. Wait, what are you doing? Um, get changing into pajamas. But why are you changing in my room? <laughs> I was told that we have to share a room. You're not staying here with me. Go choose any of the guest bedrooms. Okay. Jeez. You probably fart in your sleep anyway. Ellie, where the fuck are you? Amanda's shitting bricks. She's looking for you. Get your ass over here right now. I'm late? Uh, yeah, no, I'll be there in 10. Where are you going? Work. Have a job? Of course I have a job. How else am I supposed to pay for those? Ellie, I wanted to discuss something with you tonight. About our arrangement. Ellie, I have a proposal. Look, 
who finally decided to show up to work today. Do you even know what's happened? What, what's happened? You never told me your husband woke up. Shh, keep your voice down. Sorry I'm late, it won't happen again. Yeah, it better not happen again, or your ass is fired. Now, get to work to... Do you even know what's happened? Um, um, what, what's happened? Breaking news. Wayne Lyons of Lyons Enterprises has awoken from his coma. We are reporting live where Wayne Lyons recently checked himself out of the hospital. The Lyons family refuses to comment at this time. Details See? and news. Do you live under a rock? Uh, 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 no way! Uh, how surprising! If we can get the first scoop on this, we'll be golden for quarter two. I don't care what you have to do, Ellie. Make it happen. Psst. You never told me your husband woke up. Shh, keep your voice down. No one knows who Mary Ray is. Amanda will choke if she knew he married Wayne Lyons. She's been freaking out about him all morning. She's dying to get an interview with him. Yeah, that woman is insane. Maybe you should ask them for an interview. After all, he is your husband. Okay. I barely know the guy. Looks like you're gonna get to know the guy. Very big diamond. So, you're a magazine editor? You looked into me. Of course. I'd like to know the person I married. And? Did you find anything interesting? Mm. Nothing too unordinary. No dead bodies came up. Yet. <laughs> <laughs> Wanted to talk about something, Wayne. Sounded urgent. <laughs> What's this? It's a diamond. Very big diamond. I'm not blind. I mean, why are you showing me this? Well, you're my wife, Ellie. Am I not supposed to give you the ring? No, Wayne. You don't have to have to do that. I, I can't accept this. I mean, it's it's too ex expensive. Ellie, I want the ring back in a year. Huh? It's a prop ring. I think we should stay married for a year. As you know, I just woke up, and. Uh, eyes on me and I don't want that necessary drama right now. Are you talking about your mom? Let's just say I don't want to stir the pot right now. I think we should stay married for a year, then we divorce. That way you don't break the contract with my mother? And I will also have to have the severance after the divorce. Mm -hmm. What about <clears throat> what? The, the baby? The baby? Don't worry about the baby. I'll remove the baby from the contract. <laughs> that sounds too good to be true. Well, I wouldn't be that fast over here, but the Lions family? It's a snake pit. Are you saying that someone tried to kill you? That's out of your concern, Ellie. Are you in on this or are you out? That sounds ominous. Care to elaborate? Mm -hmm. Do you know why I was in a coma? Yeah. I, uh, I heard it on the news. In a car accident, right? Hit by a drunk driver? It's not that simple. Are 
Are you... Are you saying that someone tried to kill you? I'll look into it. That's out of your concern, Ellie. Answer my question first. Are you in on this or are you out? How many carrots is that, five? Six, actually. Listen, I know you missed out on a real wedding and... That's my gift to you. I was joking about the retiring to all. You can keep it and you should keep it. Well, I can't turn down a six carat diamond. <laughs> That I say. Look forward to working with you, Mr. Lyons. What do you want? Ellie, your father is dying. Come to the hospital to say what? goodbye. Hello. Father is dying. Come to the hospital to say what? goodbye. Hello? Hello? Bethany! He doesn't have much time left. He'd like to speak to you alone. Just no one.